So first, I will be dealing with the underexcited and underpower issue of generator 2. And since my generator is in voltage control mode, so I'm uh, going to look for a help in the help menu. And uh, let's read what's written under voltage control. Um, a generator can be selected as a voltage control regulated system, which means that the generator will adjust its wire output to control the voltage. Therefore, the generator's terminal voltage magnitude operating real power and minimum and maximum allowable reactive power supply, max Q and min Q, must be entered for voltage control generators. So we face the underexcited and underpower issue for this voltage control generator because we were actually missing uh, the data which should have been fed while before running the load flow. So it's not too late. Let's enter the data uh, now. And here in the rating tab, here I am going to enter my active power. And for MVR limits, I could either go for user defined or I could go with capability curve. Right now, I'm going with this capability curve, so it will make its calculations itself. And see um, the under-excited and under-power issue for generator 2 has been removed, but yet still we have three more errors. They are to actually overexcited and overload. Now let's see how can we remove. So first, I'm going to deal with overexcitation issue in generator one. And uh, here you can see that the generator wars limit was 526.87. MVRs and its operating war is 595.18 MVRs. So the operating MVRs are greater than its limit. That's why we are facing an over excitation issue. So while uh, in order to solve over excitation issue, um, what I have found there are two techniques. The first technique I will be uh, discussing now. What I'm going to do is that I'm uh, going to change QA and QC here. And and yeah, in this in this way, the overexcitation issue has been resolved. And um, try this method for your systems as well and if it didn't if it doesn't work out you can try different values of QA and QC and um, till now it is just a hidden trial method and if anyone knows um, a detailed you know uh, some details on this capability curve and Q and QC you please share that in the comments section um, but for the time it is working and uh, you should also try this and use different values if it doesn't work on the first try. Um, let's move toward other problems in our SLD. Now I'm going to remove our excitation issue of generator 2. And uh, the first method was to change the MVR limits, which we have done with generator 1. And the other method is to improve power factor. Because um, when your generator is in over-excited mode, it actually means that your system is running at a very uh, lagging power factor. And uh, it is also due to lagging power factor that um, 
but seven is under voltage. So improving the power factor will also help to improve the bus voltage and it would also help to remove this error. And uh, I have already made a video on power factor calculation, correction, improvement, whatever you say. Um, you can refer to that video. The link is in the description box. Um, go and check that if you want detailed calculations. And otherwise, what I'm going to do here, um, let's start. For power, uh, improved power factor, um, I will use a formula which requires active power, your current power factor, and your improved uh, or your desired power factor. So my current active power is um, 1208.6 megawatts. And uh, after capacitor sizing, I get, sorry, I, my, my current power factor was 0.85 and uh, I want it to, uh, to be improved till 0.95 and how I came to know it is 0.85 um, go and watch the video um, otherwise a very simple trick is that um, it is mentioned in the rating tab of load that power factor is 85% or you can call it 0.85 so now entering the MVR value and so, no 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 it is in KVR that why that's why it didn't make any impact on the system again I have to change it hopefully it works now um, you can cross check whether the power factor is improved or not but uh, right now we don't have time for that now I'm currently uh, going to work for this under voltage issue and a very simple solution is to provide tapping um, with the help of transformer let's try it Still not solved. Giving a greater uh, percentage for tapping uh, means you are giving it a margin of or you are giving it a wider range for voltage regulation. So this under voltage issue for bus 7 has been resolved now the only issue I am left with is overload issue so if if I change the maximum megawatt from this uh, this box this will solve the overload issue and because we are using uh, two generators so the megawatts and wars which were flowing from this generator they will be um, flown from this 850 megawatt generator one If you find the video helpful please give us a subscription if you have any suggestions or if you have any requests so um, please mention that in comment section and uh, please subscribe it